Okay, today we're going to be talking about uh, Fortnite Chapter 4 Season 2. Now, according to a Fortnite leaker who goes by the name of Wenso, or Wensoing, on Twitter, uh, I've actually got some rather interesting information concerning Season 2 of Chapter 4. Now, as you guys can see, um, it appears though we're going to be getting some first-person uh, mode, which is going to be really interesting, wall running, a bamboo area or biome, a dojo and city gym POIs, a spring activation event with challenges, new chickens and egg launches, and the May the 4th Star Wars event with the Darth Vader boss returning. Now, if we, if any previous leaks by when so are to be trusted, uh, we believe at this present moment time that most of the stuff he's got so far is correct. So, it'll be interesting to see how this turns out. Now, for those who don't know, Eric, sorry, Eric, Epic is currently working on a new Dojo POI for Chapter 4 Season 2. Also note that in version 23.4, Epic added a tag for AIs to spawn in what seems to be a bamboo biome area. So we can possibly see that next season as well. So as you guys can see, uh, this is the leaked image that we're expecting to get at some point during the next season. And also this is where, as you guys can see, we're going to expect to see some sort of bamboo area in the next map or the next um, season. Uh, we've got a cabin, what appears to be there, a chicken coop sort of POI, a class, not sure what that could be about, a desert, haunted, and a house. So that's interesting. Now this will also explain the bamboo shoots that randomly appeared and disappeared during this season. So that's really interesting to take note of there. Um, on top of this, um, con again a consequence so, information about wall running, which is an upcoming movement mechanic. You will start wall running after you sprint then press jump next to a wall. The distance you will wall run depends on your speed. The distance you will jump after wall running also depends on your speed. Now just to clear a little bit up here guys, for those who uh, know, have actually played Black Ops 3 and Black Ops 4, be familiar with the wall running. Um, for those who like to play Call of Duty, or uh, the, I think it's like Advanced Warfare, I think Advanced Warfare may have had it in. Infinite Warfare, Black Ops 3, Black Ops 4, all of that will have um, also had wall running. So that's really interesting to take note of as well. Um, so that's really interesting. Wenso also said that here's some items that were supposed to release this season, but I'm assuming that some of them will release in season two. A medkit shield potion revamp. Every second you are using the item, you'll get 10 shield HP. Exotic knockback SMG. A new burst SMG. And a DPS assault rifle. So that's interesting. Also, new core versions of these weapons. Snipers, DMR, rocket launcher, and revolver. So, that's really interesting there as well. Better explanation of the medkit rearm because you ran out of characters. If you use it for one second, you'll get 10 HP. Then if you use it for another second, you'll get another 10 HP. Then that repeats until the 10 seconds are over. So, that's interesting there. Uh, so, basically, for those who don't know, let's say you started on 1 HP. And about after one second, you'll get up to 11 HP. Then... And another second will be up to uh, 21 HP, 31 HP, 41 HP until you, until the 10 seconds are up, that's when you get up to 100 HP. So the best that's what he's saying. So that's interesting to take note of there. Uh, a threat of all upcoming or scrapped augments in Fortnite. So including Midas Touch, which gives you 40 AR ammo and 4 bars when you hit an enemy. Shotgun Gen increases shotgun fire rate. That seems a little bit overpowered if you ask me. High ground gives you an unknown item, low gravity when jumping off high ground in mid-air aiming. Knight Armoury gives you weapons like the Shockwave, Hammer and Axe Calibre. Black Market gives you unknown items out of chests like the Splash Medic Augment. Dragon Armoury gives you weapons like the Dragon Breath, Shotgun and Sniper. Riding looks to be a reload speed boost whenever you're riding on animals. SMG Gen buffs SMGs, unknown what stats due to a lack of info. Green Thumb, two times more vegetables out of produce boxes. Railgun gives you a railgun. DMR Launcher Specialist buffs the weapon also on non what stat. Grant Recon gives you a recon scanner. And here are some codenamed arguments that he currently has no information on. Double Hook, Foodie, Gun Game, Hot Pursuit, Heavy Sap, and Unstable Foot. So 
That's interesting to take note of as well. Keep to hear what you guys feel your opinions on the comments box down below. Now, Cozy of Ferrazzi, who's done all sorts of really interesting uh, trailers as of late, promoting like future seasons um, and potential future collaborations as well, is actually created some for Fortnite Season 2 or Fortnite Chapter 4 Season 2. Let me know what you guys thought of this video in the comments box down below. Make sure you guys give me a shout out. I'll link everything down in the description. Initiate countdown sequence. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. One, zero. Wow, so that looks really interesting there guys. Now just to give you a bit of an idea of what exactly happened here, um, if you take note of this uh, rather interesting piece of footage, we see Jeno, or aka the Ages Champion, uh, seems to have set up this rift gate. And with the help of what appears to be a suited up fish stick there, uh, he actually has asked the computer to initiate a countdown um, sequence, counting down from 10 and eventually all the way down to zero. And we see some sort of, maybe some sort of anti-gravity effect for a few moments there. So as you guys can see, it appears to be taking the island apart. Then after a failed attempt, or what appears to be a failed attempt, he actually manages to start up the rift gate. Which will bring other people from other dimensions into another world. Now as you guys can see, we've got a character we later found out to be Dr. Sloan. So what know you guys thoughts of this? Let me know in the comments box down below. I'm here to hear what you guys' views and opinions are. Make sure you guys subscribe, hit the notification bell, thumbs up, upload, thumbs up if you are excited to see more. Don't forget to use my support Greg on the item shop, that's one nine eight two. And it's on screen right in the description. Hashtag add, and I'll see you in the next one. Until then.